Why did the 2008 housing market collapse have such a catastrophic effect on the global economy? A new piece of evidence may provide light on the root problem. And this is quite exciting. The housing market crashed because of excessive speculation, which pushed home values to unsustainable levels. Its overvaluation was caused in large part by a flood of foreign money from China, Japan, and India. To prevent such bubbles in the future, analysts have utilized some indications as a critical factor for assessing markets and policy. When demand for homes suddenly drops, it may cause a collapse in the housing market and a subsequent drop in prices. Many elements, including economic downturns, an excess of housing units, increases in loan rates, and changes in government policy might contribute to this phenomenon. In this video, we'll look at a few of the most alarming warning signs which show that the housing market is about to implode. Economic downturns An economic downturn is a primary signal of a home market meltdown. Demand for housing may fall as a result of an economic downturn because fewer individuals will have extra money to put toward a mortgage. When individuals lose their jobs in such conditions, they may be compelled to downsize their living quarters or relocate to less expensive places, both of which reduce the demand for housing. Due to substantial job losses and a subsequent drop in house demand, the economy collapsed in 2008, triggering a housing market catastrophe. Many are now worried that the home market might collapse again as a result of the present economic crisis. Looking at historical data from prior economic downturns is a good indication of whether or not a collapse is approaching. While it is hard to foresee how this specific downturn will play out, changes in employment rates, consumer attitudes toward debt, and mortgage delinquency give crucial signals as to how the housing market is likely to respond. If an economic downturn were to occur at any time, knowing the meaning of these indications can help you prepare for it. Oversupply of housing The presence of an excess of available homes is also a strong predictor of a collapse in the housing market. This happens when there are more homes for sale than there are people looking to purchase them. When there is a boom in construction and more homes are built than the market can support, this may occur. An excess of housing may also result from a shift in government policy that encourages the building of additional dwellings. An excess of rental houses may also result from investors buying many homes with the goal of renting them out. But this is problematic if there aren't enough people looking for rental housing. The home market may see a sharp decline as a result of this. Everyone who is thinking about getting into the real estate market, whether to purchase or sell, should pay attention to the supply and demand ratio in their region. Rising interest rates When interest rates start to rise, it might be a serious warning sign that the housing market is about to implode. The cost of borrowing money, such as for a mortgage, rises when interest rates increase. There may be less of a need for homes if fewer individuals are interested in buying them because of the increased loan rates. Along with this, homeowners may find themselves in default on their mortgages if interest rates continue to rise beyond their income levels. Because of increasing interest rates, many homeowners in 2008 were unable to keep up with their mortgage payments, which ultimately led to the housing market crisis. The progressive increase in interest rates is becoming a more significant factor in determining the economic outlook of the property market. Potential buyers and sellers should think about the effects of these developments even if experts disagree on whether or not they would cause a meltdown in the housing market. For the most part, interest rates have been on the rise since 2009, when they were at historically low levels. This has led many analysts to conclude that increasing interest rates predict a housing market crash in the near future. They foresee a reduction in prices and property values as a result of fewer individuals taking out mortgages due to increased interest rates. Some analysts also worry that the higher interest rates may cause lenders to become more selective in the loans they provide. Changes in government policies Policy shifts on the part of the government are another important warning sign of impending property market crisis. For instance, if there are adjustments made to zoning laws, tax policies, or lending sector restrictions, this might affect home buyers. Increases in government taxes on real estate transactions, for instance, might cause fewer individuals to buy homes because of the added expense. In addition, a lack of new buildings due to zoning rule changes may increase house prices and possibly cause a market meltdown. 
There is a strong correlation between government policy changes and the subsequent consequences on the housing market. Tax reforms and interest rate adjustments are two examples of changes in fiscal policy that may have far-reaching effects on individual and corporate decision-making. Economists search for signs which shows whether the government is tightening or loosening policy too rapidly in order to make predictions about the housing market. Signs of an impending housing market catastrophe include changes in taxation laws, new limits on property purchases or investments, and other measures that might hinder economic activity. For this reason, forecasting the next drop in home values requires careful consideration of how governments will act. High debt levels Having a lot of debt might also be a warning sign that the property market is about to implode. Those who have a lot of debt, especially mortgage debt, may be more susceptible to economic downturns and interest rate fluctuations. But as home values fall, some homeowners may find themselves underwater on their mortgages. Because of this, the demand for housing may drop, making it harder to sell a property. For a long time now, the housing market has been a hot subject of discussion. Many people believe the market might fall at any time because of rising prices and excessive levels of debt. High levels of debt, according to a recent study by economists, may be a warning of a market meltdown in the near future. Based on the data, the housing market may be in deep trouble if household debt levels rise beyond 125 percent of disposable income, meaning that families who are spending above 125 percent of their income on mortgages and other loans may struggle to keep up with future price increases. Because of this, some of them may stop making mortgage payments or take on more debt to make ends meet, which might cause a crash in the housing market. Speculative investing Speculative investment might also be a significant warning sign of a property market meltdown. This is the case when investors buy homes with the goal of fast flipping them for a profit rather than keeping them for the long haul. An overabundance of homes on the market might result from widespread speculative investment since developers would likely construct additional homes to suit investor demand. In addition, a drop in demand for homes and prices may result if investors are unable to swiftly sell their houses. An understanding of the potential triggers which can cause a catastrophe in the property market is crucial. However, investors may use some signs to get a leg up on the competition and make educated wagers. The price-to-income ratio is one such metric. The PTI calculates the ratio of home prices to median income. A housing market bubble may be building, and on the verge of bursting when house price growth continues to surpass wage growth for a lengthy period of time. Having a high PTI signifies that prices are unsustainable, and that purchasers may not have the financial resources to keep up with the rate at which house values are increasing. Mortgage loan delinquencies and defaults are other signals that might serve as an early warning flag for investors. The real estate market collapse should serve as a cautionary tale for all of us. It's a good reminder that no matter how things are financially, we can't afford to be irresponsible. We should never make a choice without first considering how it will play out in the long run, rather than only looking at how much we stand to gain in the here and now. The market's ups and downs may have a significant impact on our lives, and with smart choices, we can always avoid a huge disaster. That's all for today, guys. If you liked this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and press the bell icon for any new updates. See you in the next one.